Leave it 5 one turn right heading 180. United Airlines replacement for the Boeing 757 has been heavily debated, rumoured and so on. However, today we finally got our confirmation with the Airbus A321 XLR being selected. In fact, the carrier has placed a firm order for a total of 50 of the type, bringing the total number of orders for the new A321 XLR to an even more incredible number, well into the hundreds. The carrier is set to use these A321 XLRs as, of course, a replacement for the Boeing 757s, but will fly the type from its hubs in New York and Washington, D.C. They'll feature heavily on transatlantic services, and the first is said to be delivered to United in 2024 with flights internationally first beginning in the following year of 2025. The Airbus Chief Commercial Officer said, We are delighted to be reunited with our friends in Chicago and thank them for their trust. The selection of the A321 XLR by the leadership of United Airlines is a ringing endorsement of the range, payload and fuel efficiency that Airbus incorporated into this state-of-the-art aircraft. The exceptional versatility and performance of the A321 XLR enables new operational efficiencies that flow to the airline's bottom line. The deal is a major setback to Boeing, who are currently going through issues with their MAX. Many believe their NMA, dubbed to be the 797, would have been the perfect replacement for the 757 with United, and even their 767. However, delays to the launch of that program has resulted in airlines like United simply not being able to wait any longer. The order for 50 A321 XLRs is valued at list prices US $7.1 billion, so quite an expensive one. However, as we know, discounts are always handed out, but, ne but never publicly revealed. The United Executive Vice President and CCO said, The new Airbus A321 XLR aircraft is an ideal one-for-one -one replacement for the older, less efficient aircraft currently operating between some of our most vital cities in our intercontinental network. While not directly mentioning the aircraft type, he means the 757s, which as we know went out of production over a decade ago. He continued on to say, in addition to strengthening our ability to fly more efficiently, the A321 XLR opens up new destinations to further develop our route network and provide customers with more options to travel the globe. United Airlines is also a customer for the Boeing 737 MAX 10, and while as mentioned in yesterday's video, that's set to compete with the A321neo, it does not quite have the range of that of the A321 XLR, which can be used for well transatlantic service. Services. We don't know the specific routes we'll see the type fly on, but as I just mentioned, United did hint that they will potentially be exploring new European destinations to serve in the future, although that's still a long way away, about five years. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you have any thoughts on this order, do let me know in the comment section below.